Good morning, survivors. Welcome back to Stranded Deep. I'm just chilling here in my bed in the Tiki Hut. It's early in the morning, just about 7 o'clock. 14th of June, 24 days survived here on our tropical island in our castaway simulator. And let's get started on our day. We got a busy, busy day today, Lil Mori. So Lil Mori there is our new friend. We killed him in the last episode. <laughs> Stuck his head on a platter. He was a giant Mori eel. His head shrunk a little bit. The head's always shrink. Trust me, he was way more impressive in the water if you saw that episode. If not, I'll put a link down below in the description. You should check it out. It's in the playlist, actually. So we have uh, we got some potatoes here growing, and now we need potatoes for fuel for the engines. And unfortunately, the potatoes grow super, super slow. And now, since we had an update recently, we actually have to water our farming plots now, too. So this is going to make things a little bit more tricky for us when we go off on an adventure like we will today. Can I jump over? Yes, I can. There you go. Have some water, little potato. Grow up big and strong, and I'm gonna have some too. Do I need it? Oh, I do. Oh, new drinking sounds. New drinking sounds. <laughs> it's empty. All right, then drop it. So yeah, I built up a new solar still here, obviously, so we can not have, so we don't have to run all the way to the other solar still on the other side of camp. <sighs> Over here. Oh, where'd you go? There you are. And deliver water to our plants, because obviously that's a hassle, because it's one little fill at a time. And do we have any potato mash all cooked up? Yeah, we do. We got some fuel in here. So let's grab a gas can and get it in Reggie because we're going on a little bit of an adventure. We're going to go get... Uh, we're actually going to build up a new, um, a new propulsion method on Reggie because we cannot rely on this fuel. Potatoes are too few and far between. And they take forever to grow. So I'm thinking we're going to need like a sail. Put a sail on you, Reg. How you feel about that, huh? A sail and a rudder. So that way, if we ever run out of gas, if we're out there exploring, we run out of gas, we can still um, we can still get home <laughs> somewhat reliably without actually having to uh, to swim. So we're gonna need cloth for the uh, the rudder. Hold on, let me just make sure I get everything because we're not gonna do it here. We're gonna bring it somewhere else. Yeah, one cloth for a sail, one cloth for a rudder. And we're gonna need we're gonna need to expand the base. Expand Reggie's base. It's all about that base, right? Yeah, I think we'll come out this way and then we'll put a sail and a rudder on him. Yeah, that's what we'll do, Reg. Reg is gonna love it. All right, let's grab uh, a compass. I just need to figure out where we're going. So this island at 90, right there. 90 has three more barrels because I wrote that down in a Google Doc uh, last time we were there. So that's where we're headed. Just want to make sure we have everything we need. Oh, we're going to need a hammer. We're going to need a hammer. That's the ball box. We'll put the balls in there. And check out my new organizational skills here, huh? Stacked up all the crates. Well, not all of them. Still got to get those up on there, but it takes forever. It's such a hassle moving these things around and getting them just right. But, uh, yeah, so we're getting there. We're getting there. I need, uh, I need a hammer. Refined hammer is perfectly fine. And I think we can go. I think we can go. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. How are we doing for food? Oh, jeez. We should eat. We should eat. We got some stuff here in Holy Smokes. Oh, sorry. Walking all over the dead bats here. Did a lot of hunting last night. Oh, ooh, did you hear that? <laughs> That's a new eating sound. Listen, I'll be quiet now. Ew. <laughs> it's a kind of a loud swallowing sound. Not very polite there. Okay, anyway, yeah, let's get a boogie. Get a boogie? Let's not get a boogie. Let's get a move on. Hey, we can boogie. Two different things, same meaning. Let's go. Slam the door. I'll be back later, guys. Uh, who's in charge? Uh, Gil. I think Gil's the most responsible out of everybody here, I think. Maybe not. All right, got everything we need. Let's pull Reggie out here and turn him in the right direction. It's a lot easier to do. Wow! Reggie, easy does it. Ow! Ho, oh, you. Listen, you want an upgrade? Then you better stop pushing. Man, he's feisty today. Feisty, feisty. Uh, yeah, there's a new sea snake. Oh, there he is. There he is. He's beautiful. But don't get too close because he's also venomous. There's another one down there. Yeah, we don't have any antidote. Oh, look at him. He's just chilling right there. Pretty nice. There's nothing else we can do with them, apparently. I mean, you can't tame them. You can't eat them. You just stay away from them. There's one more of the dangers added to the game. 
that you have to avoid. <laughs> awesome. All right, Reg, let's do this. Start your engines and let's go. Right there, that island has at least three barrels, a few wrecks that we haven't checked apparently, according to my notes anyway. Uh, there's a shelter, a campfire, and a bunch of other materials. And now that we have to find the gyrocopter parts, we're going to start um, looking around for those. And we can still go to some of these islands that have wrecks left. And then we're going to have to travel a little farther away from home and start getting all new wrecks. And maybe we can find these gyrocopter parts. So, yeah, very excited about that. Oh, watch out, Reg! There's a wreck down there buried. Now, I'm not sure which wrecks I've been to so far, but we're going to have to take a look and see. All right, thanks for the ride, Reggie. You're going to get an upgrade. Oh, look at the barrels right here. Fantastic. We have a label maker. <laughs> we got some sticks here. Oh, yeah. This place is uh, this place with the jackpot. Shelter, fire pit, uh, and some lashings, and a fishing bobber. Okay, good, good. We have plenty of supplies here. Let's build up this base. Three barrels, one lashing, and that's all she wrote. Uh-oh, what's going on here? Oh, I could put it on this side, but not that side? Maybe that's because Reggie's Beach. I don't know. Let's put him in deeper waters. Should be able to put it on the other side. I hope so. Give me that base. It's all about the base. Yes, it fits. Perfect. Look at that, Reg. You're getting big, bro. You're growing up. Okay, let's get some sticks. Let's get some sticks. Wait, do I have sticks? No. We're going to have to get some sticks. We can get them right here in this mineable scrap pile of driftwood. And four. I think it's four sticks for the floor. And I think we're going to need... Oh, I have a lashing. Good. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, indeed. Wood floor. Beautiful wood raffle. Oh, no, it's raining. No. Uh, this isn't just rain. This is like a big storm. Not cool. Just when we were upgrading Reggie. All right, Reggie, let's get you out of the water. Seas are getting rough out there, buddy. Don't want you to blow away. 61. Whoa, temperature's dropping fast. Look at that. It's getting cold. All right, we're going to get in the shelter. I think it's going to start lightning. Whoa, get in the shelter quick. Safe in here. Oh, yeah, I feel so much safer in the palm frond shelter. <laughs> Whoa, oh, that's too close. How about if we hide out in the metal boat in the water? That's not a good idea either, is it? No. Cliffs. Get to the cliffs. Get to the cliffs. Maybe there's a cave here. Ooh, that was close. Too close for comfort. And watch out for snakes. Get the sharp stick out. Sometimes there's snakes hide in here. At least the ones on land are not venomous. Ay, 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 ay. Like the ones in the water. Okay, here we go. Found a cave. Oh, okay, just gonna tuck myself in here. Whew. Okay, that's better. Listen to that storm raging out there. Wind, thunder, lightning. Wow, it's right above us. Fortunately, these storms pass pretty quickly. And we can get right back to work. Uh-oh. Oh, no. I just checked BP and now... <laughs> oh, okay, I'm out. Holy cow, I got stuck in there. I couldn't get out. <laughs> All right, let's get out of there. That, that cave is dangerous. The rock grabbed onto me. Wouldn't let go. Let's get back to work. We can't get struck by lightning in this game, so it's really not a concern. How are we doing for water? Uh, let's just have a coconut while we're here. Oh, there's a new coconut picking sound. We do not have time to waste, so I'm going to continue working here and collect resources so we can make this um, raft upgrade. That all you got? Ha 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 ha! You got nothing! Nothing at all! Look at me work! Cutting fibrous leaves, chopping wood. That's right, you better run. There he goes. There he goes. You don't scare me. All right, well, that was cool. What time is it anyway? Oh gosh, five o'clock now? Sun's already going down. Dang it! I wanted to do this in the daylight. Oh well. Yeah, I wanted to do that in the sunshine and we can take a nice lazy sail. Once we get our sail and rudder on here. But that doesn't look like it's going to happen, unfortunately. Sun is now going down. Oh, man. All right, well, let's do it anyway. Let's make the uh, let's make the sail and the rudder. We're going to need four sticks. I think it's two sticks apiece. We have a sail. Wood sticks, two. 
Well, it's got a little arrow. I guess that's the way you'll be sailing, right? Where can we put this? How do I get this on? Uh, oh, there we go. Okay. We can put it to the side. Right here. Or in the center. The only thing I don't like about putting it in the center is when we're using the uh, the engine there, we're going to be looking at a stick. We're going to have a big pole right in our face. I don't want that. So how about if we put it in the side? Uh, yeah, let's put it to one side. I hope I hope that still works okay. And there goes our sun. Dang it. And now the rudder. So we want the rudder in the back next to the motor. Same deal. If you put it on this side, you're going to be staring at a pole. So let's put it on the right side. It's going to look, look a little wonky when we're sailing. But hopefully it works. <laughs> I think we just go to bed. Let's go to bed. Yeah, it's early. But that means we'll get up a little earlier. And then we can go for our... We can go sailing. Oh, hi. Don't move, bat. Gotcha. I wasn't going to cook anything because I didn't really have a lot to cook. But now I'm thinking maybe I will get the fire going. We'll cook up uh, a little batty patty <laughs> and a crabby patty because they do have a crab over here. Sure, why not? There we go. All right, now we just have to drape the meat over the fire and it'll go to bed and it'll be done by the time we wake up. It'll stay there? Yeah, it just spins around. Oh no, that one fell off. Oh gosh, it's got all sand on it now. Corn dog. It's a corn dog. Oh, fell off again. Come on. There we go. <laughs> I love how they just hover there. All right, good night. I'll see you in the morning. <sighs> I guess it's time to get up. That was not the most comfortable place to sleep right there in the sand. That's like the olden days. Now that I have a tiki hut and a real bed. But uh, hey, beggars can't be choosy. But look at that. Oh, smells delicious. What I tell you? Batty patty and crabby patty on an open plate. <laughs> Oh, so good. Doesn't get any better than this. I mean, we, we eat like kings out here in these tropical islands as a castaway, don't we? <laughs> Seriously, this is all the freshest stuff you can get. No preservatives, no nitrates, just fresh as can be. Yeah, let's have some uh, coconut water to wash it down. The only thing we have to be careful of is diarrhea. We don't want to drink too much coconut milk, so I think two is enough. If I have one more, we'll probably get the Hershey squirts. And then uh, we'll get diarrhea, and then we'll get dehydrated, and that's no fun. All right, yeah, let's go. Let's go sail. But first, let me drop all this stuff. We'll come back for it later. But I think I want to just stick around here, around this island, and check these wrecks. I don't think I've checked them all yet. So let's get Reg out here, and let's sail away. Try this new sailing rudder. There we go. All right, climb aboard, Captain. Uh, we gotta lower the sail. Whoop. There it is. Oh, wow. That was a big piece of cloth. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are you going, Reg? Right, hold on. Grab the rudder. Reggie's got a mind of his own. Awesome. Yeah, this is fantastic. So when we're out of gas, we can uh, use our backup method of propulsion. Our sail. Clearly, it's slower than the motor. But it is reliable, and it can never run out of gas. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. All right, let's go find a wreck. And it seems to work just fine, even though the sail is on that side of Reggie and the rudder's on this side. Seems to uh, seems to operate just fine. Now, here's a wreck right here. Let's go. Oh, here's one right here. Stop. Stop. Oh, we got to get away from the rudder and then that. There's a wreck there. Oh, it's Dickie the dolphin come to play. Uh, Dicky, he always shows up when we're about to dive. Check out these wrecks. Well, we're just gonna have to go for it. I'm not worried about him. Oh, barrels! More barrels! Uh, but what else can we do with more barrels? Oh, watch out. Sea urchin. Here's a uh, loot crate right here. Pick it up. And we'll check out the insides later. I think we can go inside this one. Yeah, there's a wreck right there, too. Lots and lots of wrecks around. More barrels. And another loot crate. Snatch it. Oh, we got two consoles. <gasps> Corrugate is not bad. We're looking for gyrocopter parts. Engine vehicle part. That's a gyrocopter part. Oh, gosh. Uh, oh, go. Come on. Go, go, go. Oxygen. Yeah, I know. Thanks, BP. Oh, good. Do not pass out. Oh, that's close. Yeah, when you run out of oxygen underwater now, 
you will pass out and just die. That's it. There's no second chances. You don't lose health anymore. Like in the olden days, you just die. You pass out and die. <laughs> so we have to be super cautious now. All right, let's get this stuff back to uh, back to the beach, and then we'll come back out here and see if there's any more. But that's that's good enough for now. Let's let's go dump the stuff off, get it safely on the shore, and then we'll come back out. Cause there's a lot more wrecks here. So that engine part, that is one of the gyrocopter parts, pretty sure. We'll take a closer look when we get to the beach, where it's safe. All right. Ooh, you gotta get off the rudder first. Oh, oh man, that's not good. <laughs> Falling off the raft with the sail up. Yeah, that could be really bad. Especially if you're way out to sea. And then Reggie just takes off on you. He's not gonna turn around and come back. Not Reggie. Alright, engine part. Pretty sure that's the gyrocopter engine. Got some corrugated and a stick. Now let's open these up and see what's in. Plank scraps, compass, and a tarp. Oh, leather's real nice. We don't need the fishing spear. Jerry can, of course, is nice to have a little extra. That certainly can't hurt. Tarp. I'm actually going to dump the tarp because we have so many of them. Maybe we can make a water... Uh, yeah, we can make a solar still right here. So we don't get diarrhea from coconuts, right? Yeah. Let's whip one up right now. It's a nice little island. There we go. Solar still. Put it right there, and then we can get a coconut. Make a coconut flask, and we can drink that water when it shows up. Great. All right, yeah, this is a nice little uh, forward operating base. Let's go check out these wrecks right here, right on the shore. Oh, yeah, okay, we've been here before. We have been here before. That console is empty, and let's see. Oh, we have barrels here. Ooh, wait a second. Let's get the barrels. We could use a barrel to make a hobo stove. Or we could expand the raft, but I think uh, I think we're done expanding the raft. I don't know if we want to make it any bigger than it already is. But we can make a hobo stove here in this island. That'd be kind of nice. Yep, we've already been here, and it's just filled with rocks. This is a console that is empty. I think I just saw Dickie's tail fin. Dickie? Dickie, hi! What's up? Nope, no time to play, Dickie. Let's get out of here quick. Quick, 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 quick. Let's go back to Reggie, and we'll check those other rafts that were out in the deeper waters. But I do want to get a barrel to shore. Ow! Oh, he bit me! Dickie! Oh, you! You little... Ow! Okay, we're not bleeding. We're not bleeding. That was just a little love tap. Okay, fine. You want a love tap? I'm going to give you a love tap. I'm going to give you a love tap right back, Dickie. Let's give Dickie a love tap. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. Ready? Get him. Tag. Oh, you deked me. You sneaky little bugger. Okay, we'll get him this time. Ta oh, I missed again, didn't I? Oh, again. Dang it. Oh, ah. Woo. Okay, I think we're done playing with Dickie. <laughs> that was too close. He's starting to get rough. Okay, let's go make a uh, hobo stove if we can. I'm not really sure what that requires. Not a hobo, but a barrel, yes, and a fire... Oh, perfect! Perfect, let's bring it right over here. We've got everything we need. Put it right next to it. Look at it. And huzzah! Oh, okay, <laughs> huzzah! Hobo stove! Now we don't have to balance the uh, Krabby Patties and the Batty Patties on the fire. <laughs> we can just put it right on the stove. Oh, fantastic. That's great. All right. Unfortunately, we don't have any more crab. Oh, oh, starfish. Dang it. There's no more crabs around, but maybe we can get a bat tonight. But let's just go check one or two more wrecks out here to see if we can get any more of those gyrocopter parts. Because now I'm excited. Now that I know they exist, if we can find them here, we're going for it. All right, there we go. So this could be a problem having that sail way on the other side <laughs> of the raft because I can't reach it. And, and lower the sail. I have to let go of the rudder first. That That's going to be an issue, I think. That's something I did not think about. So I might have to chop that down and make a new one, if that's even possible. I don't know. Ugh, nope, can't reach it. So here we go. Okay, well, that worked. That was okay. That was okay. 
All right, going in. I don't see Dicky. Wee! Oh, we can go right down into the hold. Uh, oh, there's a loot crate. Let's open it up, see what's in it. Oh, what's that? A, a fuel vehicle part! Yes! That's another part for the gyrocopter. Fantastic. Okay, don't get stuck down here. Lots of grabby things, and that sounds like a dicky. Let's go, 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 go. Ah. Okay. Oh, there he is. Ah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah. He tagged me. I'm it. I'm it. <laughs> Another loot crate. And now I'm going to hide out right here. Ow. He tagged us. We are it. We are definitely it now. Let's get out of here. I don't want to get tagged again. Ugh. Ugh. All right. Fine, Dickie. We're it. Look, he's in a frenzy. He doesn't know how to play this game. You only tag once, and then you run. And then we chase him. He doesn't get it. He doesn't get it. He's just a dolphin after all. All right, let's go back to shore where all the goodies are. And we're going to take... Oh, he's chasing. He's chasing. <laughs> Dicky, I'm it. I'm supposed to chase you. Get out of here. Somebody has to teach Dicky the rules of tag. After you tag, you turn around and you run away. And try not to get tagged. But he just keeps tagging and tagging and tagging. I don't think I'm bleeding though, am I? No, I look okay. Alright, let's check out these loot crates. One of them has that fuel part, which is awesome. And this one has a gyrocopter vehicle part in it. Holy cow, we got three parts today. Ooh. Check them out. The fuel part. The engine part. And the vehicle part. Oh, that's a seat. That's the seat. <laughs> look at that makeshift thing. It's beautiful. I love it. All right, let's see what we got here. So we have the seat that's only one piece. We have two pieces for the motor. We just need the filter part, and then we can make the motor. We need the cockpit, the rotors, and the frame remaining. So, yeah, we're going to have to go hunting for those in the future. Uh, hopefully we can get all of them with the next episode or two, and then we can, uh, we can go home. I'm not even sure if I want to go home. I love it here. Fresh food, fresh water, dolphins to swim with. Yeah, it's way fun. It's way fun. All right, guys, before we say goodbye, I just wanted to show you my new hobo stove. Ooh, there's a baddie right here. Hang on, let me get him. Let me get him. Where is he? Oh, yeah, more baddie patties. Beautiful. Let's get him on. Let's get him on that hobo stove so we can uh, fill up our belly and heal up from playing tag with, um, with Dicky because I'm hurt. There we go. Four batty patties. And I think we just drop them right on top here. Oh, yeah. So nice. Oh, oh, that one's jumping around. <laughs> Still alive. <laughs> oh, yeah, perfect. That's way better than just balancing them on the actual open flame. And it's going to taste just as good. Grilled right on the hobo stove. Look at that. Delicious. And now we wait for the magic to happen. So have a seat. Take a load off. <sighs> what a day. What a day we had today, huh? People kill for this kind of thing. All right, they don't kill, but they pay a lot of money. <laughs> and here we are getting it for free. I don't want to leave. Oh, so good. Okay, there we go. 100%. We should be healing up. All right, let's blow out that fire. <gasps> yeah, we'll save this for the morning. Hopefully it doesn't spoil. But yeah, I'm not sure I want to leave this place, guys. I mean, look at this. How beautiful. Look at all the stars in the sky. Big full moon. It's so bright. It's warm. People pay a lot of money for coming out to tropical islands like this and have this kind of experience. And we get it for the goose egg. Uh-huh. But I suppose we should at least make the gyrocopter and, uh, and see what happens afterwards. <laughs> all right. I'm going to bed now. Got a full belly. It's time for bed. We'll see you guys in the morning. Good night.